What is up everyone and welcome back to my channel. Now, I just finished up, not right this second, but I just finished up Grand Theft Auto San Andreas. 10 out of 10, amazing. Such a brilliant, phenomenal game. I loved it. Oh, and I'm gonna miss it, but you know, all great things must come to an end. And today I am starting Vice City. Now I'm playing this on the PS5. Hey booty. But obviously it's just the PS2 game on the PS5. I get asked that all the time actually when I was playing uh, San Andreas. That's loud. Yo. When I was playing San Andreas and I was saying I was playing it on the PS5, people were so confused. They're like, this game ain't on the PS5. And I'm like, well, that's not what I'm saying. Hello? Okay, so this is a first playthrough. Play on tape? Oh my god, this is gonna be retro, you guys. It's gonna be retro. 2002. Let me tell you before we get into this, I'm dedicating this video to two boys, Darren and Martin. And Darren and Martin, I used to babysit them, okay, back in the day, back in the day. And I used to let them play this game when their parents weren't around, okay, oh, she's not watching this, back in the day, okay. And when I was thinking about doing Vice City, I was like, it totally reminds me of them being so cute and just being like, come on, can we play Vice City, please? And I'm gonna tell you, man, they were far too young to be playing this game, but you know, they turned out okay. <laughs> so, and if they didn't, well, I guess you can just hashtag blame Susie and it's all my fault. So I'm dedicating this video today to Darren and Martin because without them, I never would have even known what Vice City was back in the day. Back in the day. I was listening to that, okay? So I don't know who the main character is in this. I'm gonna miss CJ. I'm gonna miss all of them. Hey, hey guys, it's uh, Ken Rosenberg here. Hey, 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 great, hey. Well, uh, I'm gonna drive you guys to the meet, okay? Now, I've talked to the suppliers, and they are very uh, keen to start a business relationship. So, uh, if all goes well, we should uh, be doing very nicely for ourselves, which is, you know, good. I mean, I'm down with that. Okay, so, they're brothers, okay? One operates the, uh, the business, and the other one does the flying. So, everyone's got mustaches. Is this the 80s? <laughs> is this the olden days? Imagine the first mission has okay, me like flying Okay, that's them in the chopper. Helicopter. All right, here's the deal. They want a straight exchange on open ground. All right? Okay, stay tight. Let's go. Okay. Oh shit. This ain't gonna Oh no. Mm -mm. Got it. 100% pure grade A Colombian, my friend. Let me see it. The greens? 10s and 20s, used. I think we have a deal, my friend. <laughs> I think you did. Oh, shit. Come on, get out of here, Okay, well, someone lived to tell the tale. You would check the area though, am I right? If you're gonna do like an exchange like that, you would secure the area. I poked my head out of the gutter for one freaking second and fate shoveled shit in my face. Go get some sleep. What are you gonna do? I'll drop by your office tomorrow and we can start sorting this mess out. Okay. Oh wow, okay, so. There's a few things, and um, follow the pink blimp to find the hotel. 
obviously Vice City was before San Andreas and the reason I wanted to go for Vice City just now I, I know a lot of people were asking for four is that graphically I don't think I could go up to four and then come back to Vice City does that make sense it would be too weird oh my goodness okay let's Oh, I don't even move the camera Daddy in this one. For a dollar. So the camera just follows me. Okay, let's have a look at the map. So cute though. I'm gonna go to audio. You guys know the drill. The voice of unprofitable the music has to go right down because YouTube and she's gone. ruins everything. The okay. A note scrawl, the sound of right. Excuse me? Got the option between a car and a bike. And, uh, whoa. Okay, let's go! Can I change the, oh shoot. The view. Okay, so that's to change the radio. Apply the handbrake. No. Storm warning. Oh, okay. I was gonna say, I was looking at the map! Come on, car. Come on, car. So yeah, I'm gonna play four after this one. It controls like... Florida, morons. <laughs> it controls so different, just because I'm like... I'm so used to San Andreas that this is weird to me. But it's okay, I'll get used to it. I mean, San Andreas was weird to me in the beginning. It's so pretty, this game, though. You. So walk through the front door of the Ocean View Hotel to enter the building. It's pretty. Now I remember in three, when not a, a mission you can save. Walk into the pink market to continue. Uh, crap, what was I gonna say? In three, the main character didn't speak. Now I'm assuming in this one, my main character speaks. I guess I'll find out when I uh, go into the pink marker. I like your shirt though, sir. An old friend. Hoo hoo hoo. Is it CJ? <laughs> Hello, Sonny. Tommy! Tommy, it's been too long. I know, I know. You're just overwhelmed with emotion. Fifteen years. Seems like only yesterday. I guess that's a perspective thing. Hey, doing time for the family is no piece of cake, but the family looks after its own, okay? So how'd the deal go down? You sitting on some white gold? Look, Sonny, we were set up. The deal was an ambush. Harry and Lee were dead. You better be kidding me, Tommy! Tell me you still got the money. No, Sonny. I don't have the money. That was my money, Tommy! My money! Okay, it wasn't my fault. You better not be screwing me, Tommy, because you know I'm not a man to be screwed with. Wait, Sonny. You have my personal assurance that I'm going to get you your money back and the drugs, and I'm going to mail you the dicks of those responsible. Hey, I already know that. You're not a fool, Tommy, but I warn you, neither am I. If it was anybody else, you'd be dead already. But because it's you, because we got history, I'm going to let you handle this. Look, Sonny, you got my word. I'll be in touch. Oh my god, that guy's scary. That phone didn't deserve that. To find the lawyer's office, follow the L on the radar. Okay. Yeah, it's so weird. Like, I was so used to um, San Andreas. Look at my car. Yikes. Press select to change camera. Oh. Okay, further away is good. Is that the same in the car? Oh, whoa! I didn't notice that there was police there. Excuse me. Aha, there we go. Whoa, that's that's a lot. Uh, I guess that'll do. What the heck? I just put... I put my finger on uh, square. Oh, is this car jacking? This car cray. Like... And it like turns itself. 
It's like a Tesla! Self-driving. Okay, where's the L? <laughs> Sorry. Sorry. My bad. The party. Welcome to the party, pal. Go get some sleep, he says. <laughs> I have been sitting in this chair all night with the lights off drinking coffee. This is a disaster. We are so screwed, man. These gorillas, listen to me, are gonna come down here and rip my head off. It's re ridiculous. I did not go to law school for this. Okay, now what the hell are we gonna do? Shut up, sit down, relax. I'll tell you what we're gonna do. You're gonna find out who took our cocaine, and then I'm gonna kill them. That's a good idea. That's a great idea. Let me think, let me think, let me think. Oh. There's this retired colonel, Colonel Juan Garcia Cortez. He's the one that helped me set up this deal well away from Vice City's established thugs, okay? Now listen, he's holding his party out in the bay on his expensive yacht and all of Vice City's big players are gonna be there, okay? I have an invite, of course I have an invite, but there's no way that I'm going out there sticking my head out the door, no I way, not I told you, happen. shut up, I'll go myself. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hey, I like 1978 too, but you know, this isn't gonna be a beer and strippers do. I mean, no offense, but I think that you might turn heads on the runway for the wrong What's reasons. What's wrong with the way I'm dressed? Okay, look, here, stop by Raphael's. Tell him I sent you. He'll make you look respectable. Okay, go, come on. There's nothing wrong with my shirt. I was recently watching the Olympics, okay? Now I gotta Loving dress like it. A chump as well as hang out with them? I like this shirt. Yeah, there's nothing wrong with that shirt. And there was someone that had like peacocks and all of that good stuff, you know. All right. What should I get? Follow the t-shirt blimp on the radar. Should I get um, a suit? I guess it depends on what I can afford, but I feel like I should get a suit. Now I promise you guys, right? I'm gonna learn to drive in this game. This game, it's gonna be the game. So, um, why, why are you there? I just flipped my car, like. So as I was saying, um, yeah. Not busy. This game will be the game that I learn to drive. How do I punch? Oh yeah, what are you gonna do, hmm? I'm gonna go get some new threads and you ain't gonna stop me, okay? It's not gonna happen. Oh, nice shoes. Doesn't suit me. Hmm, nice bike. <laughs> oh, I keep forgetting. I'm not used to using oh, the uh <laughs> Oh my god. Shift my way. Oh, okay. That's that's different. Fair enough. Oh. Why? Why is it when you break in this game, the car wants to automatically uh do that? Go. Excuse me. Why does it want to do that? Oh my god, look at my character. I'm just like... I know I, I've got the suit. I stole the bike. I probably need a gun for this mission, right? No? Maybe it's too soon. <laughs> it's not taught me about guns yet, gosh. Buenas noches. I understand you are here on the behalf of Mr. Rosenberg. I hope any recent problems have not affected his health or mental well-being, Mr. Versetti. He's just got a touch of agoraphobia. <laughs> excellent, excellent. And you? I just want my merchandise. Ah, it's an unfortunate set of circumstances for all involved. Of course, I have initiated my own lines of inquiry, but such a delicate matter will take time. Perhaps we'll talk later. Meanwhile, let me introduce you to my daughter. 
Mercedes! Oh, hey, hey girl! Uh, could you look after our guest while I attend to my necessary obligations? Of course, daddy. Please, excuse me. That's so weird, Mercedes? like, pouring out your daughter like that. Anyway, let me point out some of our more distinguished guests. That's our congressman Alex Shrub with rising silicone star Candy Sucks. And have you met my lovely wife Laura? Candy nope. Sucks. Uh, unfortunately, she's an alien. I thought she was a blow-up doll. And over there, we have the Vice City Mamba star titan BJ, always the charmer. I blocked down on him and then I put him in a wheelchair. <laughs> <laughs> that is good. Well, now I'm looking at some prime. Risk. And that poolside amphibian is Jez Torrent, lead singer with. Love fest. Yeah, can I tell you? Do you know how they play ping pong in Thailand? Let me tell you. Oh no 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 no! I will get demonetized if we talk about that. And the chatty trio, that sleeping sweat gland is Papa's right hand gimp, Gonzalez. And the other two are Pastor Richards and pseudo intellectual film director Fish Steve Wall Scott. Throws a passion with the Nipho invaders when the giant shark comes in and just bites their dicks off. I know, you never saw anything like that before. Colonel, My friend has probably reviewed that, that maybe. Triumph. <laughs> I can only apologize. Well, the another day. amigo. How do we find you? <laughs> Our business is very tri. Barbarians at the gate. A time for rewarding one's friends and liquidating one's enemies, amigo. Who's the loudmouth? Ricardo Diaz. He's Mr. Cole. Mercedes! Oh, I was just taking my friend back into town. Another time, Ricardo. Ricardo, let's go. Let's get the out of here. Sure Actually, take me to the proposition. Drinks. Okay, I mean, I just got here, but why not? So, take his daughter to the pole position club? Um, you know, this game, this game, it does not mess around. Will you be working for my father? Maybe. You mind me resting my hand in your lap? Maybe. Oh! It's so difficult having a rich and powerful father. Vamos. I mean, yeah, it must be so hard to just, like, always get what you want and... <laughs> Can't relate. See you around, handsome. So, is this a strip club? I'm sure you will. Girl got sass. Oh, <gasps> wait. There's no. I was waiting for like the the song to play or or something. Like I feel like I need to pan in the um the San Andreas one. That's so sad. Oh. Well, we can sing it together. That's okay, I guess. So I like my character. He's not as sassy as CJ was and I, I guess that's okay it's gonna take a bit to get used to this game because it I know it's like one down but it definitely feels different you know not in a bad way it's just you can tell that there was a lot of changes made. Ah, well, I hope you're having a good time came. because I'm going out of my mind with worry here. What did you find out? That there are more criminals in this town than in prison. We need a lead from the streets. Okay, let me think, let me think, let me think. Ah, I got it. Okay, there's this slimy, some music industry slime ball. Goes by the name of Kent Paul. Anyway, he's got his nose so far up most of Vice City's ass that if anybody knows the whereabouts of 20 keys of coke, it's this guy, all right? He's always at the Malibu. I'll go pay him a visit. Ah, oh, my Take favorite easy, no. alcoholic drink is Malibu. What's yours? Let me know in the comment section. What do you like to drink? Or, if you're too young... It's funny because in the UK, uh, the legal age is 18. So you can go get hammered on your 18th. And interestingly enough as well, and I feel like a lot of Americans don't know this, you can have sex in the UK at 16. So like you can date, you can do all of that stuff at 16. Do you know how annoyed I get when I see people like, oh my God, like you had sex with a minor, you're a pedo and it's like, in our country, 16 is the legal age, and I think it's 18 in the States, so a lot of people, they just assume that everywhere is 18, but it's not. 
So, ah, fun fact for you guys. Although, so I do kind of think that 16 is like quite young. Where'd you pop up from? I've been looking for a bird like you for ages, mate. You know what? I'm looking for some English guy. Kent Paul. Kent Paul, mate. Yeah, I'm the governor, Andy. I'll sort things out. You know what I mean? I'll treat you. Whatever you want, I'll get you, girl. Don't you worry about a thing, mate. Get lost, honey. Oi, 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 oi. You Kent Paul? I'm a friend of Rosenberg's. Rosenberg? Rosenberg? Oh, that bonkers ambulance chaser. That guy could defend an innocent man all the way to death row. <laughs> Get another drink, bruv. Everybody's an idiot. <laughs> Listen to me. I'm missing 20 keys and a lot of cash. Drugs, mate. It's a mugs game. What do you know about it? Oi, oi, well, what I was coming to was, there's some chef come trumpet shifter who deals that kitchen of Hotel and Ocean Drive. He's been looking real pleased with himself lately. You could go and check him out. I will. And I'll be seeing you around. It's like a big dick energy, isn't That's it? That's right, go and walk away, you mug. I knock you spark out. Give me a drink. And where's that slut? Oh, yeah, you knocked me spark out? Honey, your ass was on the floor. Okay. On the floor. All right, let's go find the chef. Is it like chef from South Park? I was actually going to say something about chef from South Park, but then I was like... I don't want to spoil anything from South Park. I don't know if you guys are into South Park or not. I freaking love it. It's like one of my all-time favorite shows. And, uh, yeah, I don't want to get too into it. Hey, spoiler. what you looking at? You better start talking. Hey, make me, you prick. Okay. You think you can fight me? Punch me. Can I lock onto him? Uh oh. I'm gonna kill him! Oh dear. I killed him. <laughs> I can now receive phone calls. Oh no, but what if Catalina gets my number? She'll be having sex. Oh, calling way to me go, up. tough guy. Beat him to a pulp. That should make him real chatty. You want some too? Hey, chill. I want what you want, brother. Oh, yeah? And what's that? Your green and my dead brother's white lady. Unfortunately, you just silenced our lead. Accidents happen. Get lost. Hey, hey, whoa. Well, no need to go all long range on my ass. The way I see it, we two hombres in a strange town. We need to watch each other's back. My back's just fine, brother. You sure about that? Here, take this. Follow me. Oh shit, shooting the chef. Okay, how we do, how we do. This way. Guns are legal in Vice City, huh? This town is a pain in the ass. Excuse me, sir. Okay, so very similar to San Andreas. Uh, pick up the... Hold on. Oh, okay, so it'll actually replace it, I see. So I got a gun, a knife, and my bare fist. Right, where did my buddy go? Okay, let's just get the, is that to get the police off me? Okay, oh, nice. I keep pressing the right analog stick to move the camera. It's so awkward because that's what I'm used to doing. One thing you gotta realize about this town, you gotta pack some heat. Local gun shops, a couple of blocks away. Oh shit. Oh! Goodness me. It's a shame because the soundtrack in this game is absolutely phenomenal already. But I'm like, I just know what that means. It means that as soon as it goes on YouTube, it's like, this video is blocked, this video is blocked, 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 everything is blocked, blocked, blocked. And that's what I hate about music on YouTube is that I understand that the relevant artists should get paid for their work, right? I get that. But me. You hit me. I'm just playing a game, you know? So when they try and take all your revenue or they try and block it for like 30 seconds of a song, 
horse shit, okay? It's frustrating. Okay, I only got a hundred bucks. I am seriously poor right now. Yo, why you all up on me? Wait, that was it? All right, okay. I highly doubt I can afford very much right now, so this is a nice car, I like it. I can't get to grips with the braking and then that turning the car like sideways. I feel like that's gonna get me. It's, yeah, it's like I'm accidentally handbrake turning constantly and I don't want to do that. So as per usual, I will not be tweeting, cheating. I will not be using cheat codes or anything like that. We're just gonna play this I'm gonna go as intended. I'm gonna dig up. I'll be watching you, Tommy. Oh, I'm so terrified. <laughs> right, I want to go into display and I'm going to put the subtitles on. Whoops. Oh god. Ah. Uh, okay. Cool. So what is... So what was that place? Sit on my knee. Uh, no, I don't want to sit on your knee. Thank you very much. There's just an overall, like, different vibe in this game. Like, I don't know how to describe it. Not a- nothing bad or anything like that. It just... Whips. It just feels different. I don't know. I mean, I guess it is different. I think you- you just get so used to playing a different game, and sometimes it is hard to go back. But I think we'll be fine with this game, as long as the difficulty doesn't ramp up. <laughs> there was a lot of crazy missions in uh, San Andreas. There was... whoopsies. There was a bit of rage. Uh-oh. If this is Catalina... Hey, uh, Leo, I think we got a buyer for Diaz's merchandise. Gotta give him a ring, man. Set up the deal, you know? Where are you now? You okay, Leo? You sound kinda different. Just tell me where you are. Who the hell is this? Put Leo on, man. Leo's gone away for a while. He left me in charge. Screw you, man. <laughs> Whoopsies. There's a lot of sexy ladies hanging about this place, isn't there? Ah! Oh, oh, for God's sake, it's you. Oh, jeez. I'm gonna need new pants. Hey, those psychos from up north, they've been on the horn, and they're coming down here soon. Now, where is the goddamn money? Relax, relax. We're not at that point oh, yet. Oh, I thought that you were taking care of this. I really did. And now those guidos say we gotta do them a favor. You mean I gotta do them a favor? Oh, of course that's what I mean. Do I look like I can intimidate a jury? I couldn't intimidate a child, and believe me, I've tried. Now look. <laughs> It's either that or Ferelli's cousin Giorgio gets five years for fraud. You gotta take these guys out. I understand. Help the jury change their minds. Don't worry about no, it. No, 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 no! I tried that. The jury case didn't go so well. So make them change their minds. Well, right, more crap to wipe up. What I did just learn how to shoot life? people. I did just kill a bunch of people. This would be easy. Easy, 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 easy. So how are you guys anyway? Um, it's been a pretty crazy couple of weeks. Okay. Dumb Florida moron. <laughs> uh, you can follow the hammer blip on your radar. If you want to buy melee weapons from the hardware store. Okay, um, so I got a gun and a hammer, that's about it. I'm only going to intimidate them. Wait, can I pick up a lady? Anyone? Anyone? Well, screw you then, bitch. You ain't getting none. You ain't getting none of that. Yeah, so it's been a difficult week. Um, I'm still recovering. My face is just... It just feels weird, you guys. I don't know how else to put it. It just feels weird. 
So I've got hospital appointments next week. I'm doing blood tests, which... Uh, not for me. Probably not for anyone. Um, and then I have an MRI on the Friday. So I'm nervous because I don't know what they're going to find, if anything. I don't know. I just want them to tell me that it's something really basic that's going to heal. You can smash cars up by using the hammer. Ooh. Yeah, get fucked. You can't shit. <laughs> I'm a nice soul. I don't want to set it on fire, though. I don't want to do too much damage, do I? Okay, I think I'm done. Is there another part of the car I need to hit? Can I jump in this game? Hold on. Oh, I can. Because the roof is looking awfully nice. Oh, this car is going to blow. I can't believe this is happening. Giorgio sends his regards. Ah! <laughs> Sorry about that. So yeah, I have an MRI. I've never had one before. My mom says they're like fine though, like they're they're not painful or anything like that. How did this happen? It's just to basically have a look at the inside of my face, my brain, and things like that. And I mean, I would say I'm excited, but that I guess that would be kind of weird. I'm more just excited to know what is wrong with me, I guess. Um, yeah, it's been a long nine months of trying to get like a proper, what's the word I'm looking for, diagnosis, I guess, um, with what's going on with my face and my nerves. And initially it all started off as just like a wisdom tooth thing and then it, it probably wasn't that. So I've lost a lot of teeth this year, I will say that much. And my mouth just feels kind of empty. <laughs> um, yeah, it's not great. Okay. Um, hello. Oh. Okay, that was unfortunate, but I don't care. <laughs> Get out the car, sir. Hey, man, my car. Get out the car. Get out the car! Yo, man, I still got payments to make on this! Well, not anymore, you don't. Get out the car! Oh, please, God! Someone help me! Remember, uh -huh. guilty is a dirty word. <laughs> oh, look, shit, the police. Ah, the police didn't even do anything! That's so funny. Can I steal the car that I just messed up? <laughs> well, I mean, someone might as well put it to some good use. Uh, let's go this way. Yeah, it, it really sucks sometimes because people would be like, oh, what was wrong with her? And then other people are like, oh, nothing. She just had her wisdom teeth removed. And it's like, I wish that that was the truth. <laughs> I mean, I did have them removed, but that's not like the main thing. Hey, Tommy, it's Sunny. How's the sun tan? I ain't got no suntan. Well, you ain't got my money either, so I'm one of them myself. What are you doing? So tell me, tell me, what are you doing? This I'm looking for the side. money, Sonny. So Don't worry. I am worrying, Tommy. That's my style, because I didn't have this problem in my life with unreliable people. Don't be an unreliable person, Tommy, please. Do us both a favor. I'm looking forward to hearing from you. Look at those big oh, man. I don't like this. I don't like that guy. Right, I'm gonna save it. So yeah, it's the 1st of September. Where has this year gone again? Are you still in lockdown where you are? Uh, I'm not in lockdown where I am. I've had both cases of the vaccine and... This, uh, yeah, the vaccine's a, a really touchy subject, which is 
funny because I never thought it would be. I don't know why I never thought it would be. Get to the payphone next to the mall in Washington. Um, okay. Am I being rushed to do this? Like, I don't see a... Oh god. Someone turn the alarm! Turn up the alarm. Oh man, the police are coming! Okay, we're good. I'm going, I'm going, I'm going! I missed it. <laughs> that I've not been able to eat properly for donkeys. Oh shit. That's that's not great. That's not great. Should've gone that way. Yeah, I wasn't able to eat for it. Hello. Okay. Where is this guy? Is he on oh I see ya. I'ma knock you off your bike Someone's not getting their pizza tonight Oh Oh Sir? Sir? Oh, he's there, look Sir? Sir? You're not delivering no pizza tonight no! <laughs> so does it play a bit of music? Yeah, like a wee bit, I guess. Stupid damn prick! Wow, my cat is really impressive. So what was I saying? Oh yeah, lockdown. So the cases in Scotland are through the roof right now. We have about 5 million people in our country. And every day we've been having like between seven and eight thousand cases a day. Yikes. And we went into a full lockdown back in 2020 when we only had like 400 cases. So, y you know, things have changed a little bit. Um, it's a shit show, I'll be honest with you. So, I haven't had COVID. Without saying, for the Tommy, record. Tommy, any progress? No, 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 no. Tell me later. Tell me later. Tommy, this is Avery Carrington. I believe you met at the party. Not in person. Howdy. Avery here has a proposition. <clears throat> Haven't we got other things on our mind? I'm trying to keep the wolves from the door. So could you please cut me some slack? I'm stretched like a wire, and even if I'm dead by the end of the week, I'd like to think that I didn't die poor. Now just okay? calm down, both of you. Son, you help me, and any greaseballs giving you a hard time, I'll see to it they take a long dirt nap. Okay. What could I do for you? This delivery company's got its depot on some prime land. They won't sell. They're hanging on like a big old prairie rat. So we gotta go in there and smoke that vermin out. Head on down there and stir up a hornet's nest. The security will have their hands full, and then you can sneak in and put them out of business. And you could drop by Raphael's for a change of clothes. You might be there a while, but yeah, go for it. Should be a riot. If the balls drop like they should, stop by my office sometime. Who Should be a anyway? riot. Lawyer pricks, rug wearing pricks, surrounded by pricks. I love this main character. Like, he's so mad at the world. Listen, dude, if you didn't fuck up your job in the beginning, then, you know, maybe shit would have been different, but you balls up. And this is where we're at right now, I hate to say. So, not that it was his fault. It was a setup. Right, so what clothes am I getting? Do I get to pick this time, or am I just gonna go... There's a lot of police around here. Every time I seem to go get new clothes, I always have the police chasing me. 
So leave me alone, I'm just getting my Gucci. I mean, Gucci would probably sell that, for the record. I, I wouldn't put it past them, to be honest with you. Listen, I love Gucci. I made a lot of money recently, which is nice. Um, but growing up, I didn't have, like, shit. You know, I came from a really, really quite poor family. We were lucky if we had any freaking ham in our sandwiches as a kid in primary school. But anyways, so now that I can actually afford to put some ham in my sandwich, I've also decided that I like Gucci as well. So there you go. Uh, I need to here. Oh. Start fighting with at least four workers to get a rise. So, well, I can do that. One, two, two, three, four, five. Oh shit! If you take out someone who's holding a weapon, they will drop it. Okay, I mean, I've got a gun. Oh, so does he. Excuse me, sir. Stop fucking shooting me. <laughs> yeah! This is fun. Uh, excuse me, I need to change the camera. Wait, I gotta fuck up this thing. Um, can you guys fuck off? Listen, I'm, I got shit to do, right? This is my mission. This is my mission. This is my mission. My mission. Am I bleeding? Okay, it, it seems to take quite a while to, uh... Vampire. We can do it! Come on! There we go. Okay, I gotta get- Ah! Excuse me! Hey, that was good. That was a fun mission. <laughs> hey, and the, the police came off too, which is really good. So, first, sorry, I was reading that. Um, first thoughts of this game. It makes me horribly motion sick, that's to be expected. <laughs> um, I like the main character. It's very gangsta, as always. Um, the music is awesome. And I think I'm really going to like this game, so I am going to... Yeah, it's a bit framey. Uh, it's the only thing that will probably set off my motion sickness, but I have tablets to get around that, so that's not... It's not the worst thing in the world. No! Hola, is this Mr. Versetti? Yeah. Uh, this is Cortez. You were at my party? Yeah, I remember. Uh, Mr. Versetti, it was a most unfortunate incident that happened with your business deal. I know. I want you to know me and my people are doing their utmost to get to the bottom of it. If you'd like to talk to me more privately, you can find me at the boat, huh? Okay? Good day, senor. Ooh. Okay, we're getting a, a ton of missions very early on. So, who's screwing over who in this game, huh? I wonder. Right, I'm gonna go ahead and save it. I'm all out of time for this first episode. Really great game so far. It's um, it's a bit strange going from San Andreas to this one. Obviously, it's like a decrease in quality with graphics and things like that. But hey, it's still GTA and I started GTA with the very first game on PS1. So this is nothing in comparison to that. You know, that game was... Uh, I feel like I should revisit that okay, at some baby. point, but I don't know. I don't even know if I can play that again. 
It's not on PC, that's for sure, but maybe I can dig out my old school PS1. I don't know how I would do it. But regardless, make sure you are subscribed to my channel like always. Thank you so much for all the love and support. I think we just recently hit 26,000 subscribers as well. So mwah, thank you, and I will catch you all in the next episode. Thank you for watching. Bye.